was that something that was discussed? Did Mark just throw it? He kind of wanted to know about that decision to end the fight. Uh, yeah. And I'll Mark, let you guys go. Check, check, check. Uh, Mark threw the towel. Um, I didn't think he should have. Uh, Deontay's the kind of guy that he's the kind of guy that's a go out on his shield kind of guy, and he would tell you straight up, "Don't throw the towel in." In fact, in the dressing room when Tyson was getting his hands wrapped uh, in one of the earlier fights, which they show on the screen in the locker room, they uh, they had a guy that uh, got stopped. We were like, "Stop the fight! Stop the fight!" And right when the ref stopped the fight, the towel came in, and and Tyson looked at his people and said, "Never." like that. And I said, yeah, that's the same kind of guy Deontay is. He, he does not want that. And, uh, and then you've always got to consider also that Deontay is a, is a, is a fearsome puncher. So that's always a difficult thing because, you know, he does have that, always have that shot, uh, to land a big shot and turn things around. So, um, that, that's what happened there. But Deontay is, is, um, is doing well. Uh, and he's, uh, you know, he'll be back He'll be all the better for it, but um, congratulations, absolutely, to Tyson and to his to his team. A class act all the way around, and we're we're thrilled to be part of the show with him. Shelly, while you have you up here too, will you give him your microphone real quick? If you if you have anything you'd like to say, or if there's any questions, up, we're gonna get their questions and then let let them go. But if, if there's anything you'd like to say, obviously Deontay Wilder has 30 days to decide if he wants to take the rematch with Tyson Fury. Well, going in. And contrary to what um, Fury said last fight and continues, I think he knows I have a lot of respect for his ability, always did. And the on-tails take the time, but you will see these guys in the ring again. Everyone was saying a rematch, this is it. The winner of that will then decide how it goes, right? Do you have any questions for these two men back there? Straight back. I have a question for is Tyson. We're gonna go. Oh. We're gonna open it up to. Okay. to I just want to let Shelly and Jay go. If anybody has a specific question for them too, so they can go take care of their fighter. Well, I'll ask. Yeah. I have, I'll ask Jay one question then. Go ahead, Dan. Jay, I know it's right after the fight. Did Deontay say anything to you or to Shelly in the dressing room afterwards that he would want to pick up that immediate rematch? We discuss it now, but. I have told him many times, I don't expect to die, but I've had insurance for 50 years. You have the rematch for a reason, no matter what. Anyone else right here? Jay, what, Jay, what, is, uh, Jay, what is the extent of uh, Deontay's uh, injuries, if any? He had, he, he had uh, a small cut inside the ear, um, may have affected his equilibrium. Uh, and so he's just going to get a couple of stitches there. That's that's really the, the the extent of it. It was a tough, grueling fight with with a with a tough, grueling fighter. And uh, so coming from two fights in a row, November, February, which he loves to be active, but uh, this will this will give him some time to uh, to enjoy things, enjoy his family, and, um, and and rest up a little bit. So I think that's that's what will be the next step. Uh, Jay, Jay, all the way in the back. Can you just can you clarify what was going on in the corner before the towel was thrown? Does does Mark have the authority to throw the towel in like that? I mean, yeah. were you talking back and forth? Just that whole one minute long process. What, what was going on there? Well, I'm I'm the head coach of the team, but we do things a little bit differently. Ninety nine percent of the time, the head coach of the team is also the guy that's the lead in the corner. Ours is a little bit more like a football team, American football, where the head coach doesn't necessarily call the plays. You have an offensive and defensive coordinator. So ours is a little bit like that. So what happened between rounds was Mark said something about possibly throw, I mean, uh, during the round, Mark said something about throwing the towel in, and I told him, uh, uh, don't do that. Uh, I, I didn't think he should do that. And um, then the fight went a little bit longer, and then I saw the towel go in so we haven't I haven't talked to Mark about it um, but we'll, we'll we'll talk about it and figure out what you know what exactly happened there uh, Jay just what you were talking about with you know Deontay wanting to go out on his shield I, that would lead us to believe that he will want this fight again you know whether it happens sooner or later what is your exact opinion on you know his willingness to get back in there against Tyson? yeah I, I think absolutely um, you know, my guess is knowing him like I do, that he will absolutely want to uh, 
rematch. And um, I mean, these guys have put on two tremendous fights already. So I certainly think that the uh, the public, you know, will, will want it. And uh, I think we'll want it, and I think they'll want it. And so it seems a, it seems a natural. So I think I think uh, I think that's what you'll see happen. One more for Jay or Shelley, and then we're gonna let them go. One more. Any? Hi, this uh, question is from Tyson, uh, Ryan O'Hara with FightNights.com.